Good morning, everybody. It's uh, fantastic, Mr. Ghost. Welcome back to the Valheim Ashlands. And I have a boar out here that's going nuts, <laughs> I think. Oh, uh, God, these animals. Yeah, all of a sudden, I'm starting to get animal spawns in my base. Regardless of what I've done, fires and workbenches, and I have the materials for this new sword. Let's go ahead and make it. And boom. New item. Oh my gosh. Oh, that man, that zipped. And there it is. Oh, wow. This is cool. It's a flame sword. Nice. I like that. I like all the... Man, they're really doing a bang-up job here. So let's check upgrades. One gem, ten flametal. I went out and got... I think it was three forts. And I'm like, okay, I've had enough. <laughs> I have 11 of these eolite, I think it's called. Five of the jade here. And one red gem. Or blood gem. Uh, bloodstone. So this is called Jadia. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, you can see that, well, I've made a few things with the jade. And the red, the bloodstones seem to be the most rare. And I think they do that intentionally. So that you're constantly grinding. I don't appreciate that. But I am not a develop. you know, they want you to keep playing their game. I think it's a scam. All right, let's upgrade this thing. So it goes up. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, wow. Okay, 151. Okay, it goes up, and then the fire stays the same. Durability always goes up. Man, durability is pretty low. Block armor, 57. Block force, 20. That goes up to 25. Knockback stays the same. Okay, so let's go ahead. And this might be it, and it is. Two freaking bloodstones. Okay. So, uh, yeah. I'm... Man, that's pretty cool. Ha! <laughs> Alright. So we got that new sword. And I think it will do very well against all enemies. I don't know how... Well, I'll have to test it out in the, uh, you know, the Ashlands here. I always fumble on that. I don't know why. So, uh, I'll keep an eye out for some enemies. None really here right now. It's daytime. The next thing that I have on the docket for today, as promised, is the freaking trader. Bonk. Okay. So, I, uh, I found her. And I made this gate right here. Hilder. Oh, what do I have? Oh, I have the extra stuff. I, uh... How'd I grab? Was it 10? Oh, maybe I, I don't know. Sometimes I look at it and I don't know. Alright. So, apparently, according to the wiki, she will spawn in the meadows and 1,500 to 3,000 meters or something. Some kind of really big number. Away. From your spawn point. Now she has these wards here. Okay. I, I, now what's weird is she is actually in the plains. If you see this. This right here is meadows. But So she's right on the border. And I had to take this camp out over here. <laughs> so here she is. And now it's kind of island hopping. And I figure, well, let's just head in one direction. Ah, what's that? I'm a, a greedy little bit. You want to go, go after me? Would you? So she has some quests. Hello. Uh, hello. My wares are made out of the finest cloth. Okay. So what does she have here? Simple dress. Apparently, she has quests. Give item. I don't know what this is all about here. So, tunic, natural. Um, 
Stamina. 20. What is this anything? 20 stamina. Okay, and then there is a red cap. Uh, base stamina 15. Okay, so it's a stamina thing. And then we've got a purple stamina. And a simply a fashionable cap. And sparkler! It's a stick that sparkles pretty. Okay. Wow. What is this thing here? Durability 8. <laughs> stamina. I would imagine you can stick this into an enemy's head. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny. Maybe you could put these up in your base, you know? Iron pit! Oh, uh, we need to fill with firewood and kindling. Can't be teleported. Oh, that's weird. Why can't you teleport it? Now we got a barber kit. A kit fit for the finest of barbers. Okay, that's weird. So I'm wondering... how. Oh, E is talk, yeah. Give item. Well, okay. How do I get her quest? Why is she just offering it? Well, let's get some gold. And maybe if we buy something from her... She will, uh, oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'll have to set up my stone portal, or a stone portal here. I didn't think I was going to need it. And then we can bring that pot back here. So let me get my gold and, and a stone portal, and we'll head over there. Okay, I'm back here. It says most of my stuff was stolen from me. I've marked out where it was on the map. Oh, there it is. Oh, she marked it. Oh, okay, it flashed up pretty quick. So where... Where... How do I know where it is? I got so many darn... Uh, mar map markers. <laughs> how am I supposed to find it? So I wanted to buy... Iron Pit. Oh. There we go. Okay, I brought some stuff to sell. I like how she goes... Rrr, rrr. Oh, look! Iron pit, iron fire pit. Okay. And let's buy this. Barber kit, barber station. Oh, cool. All right. I want to buy a sparkler. New item sparkler. Now, I suppose we can buy these things here. They're not that expensive. Um, oh, my inventory, I think, is full crap. There we go. Now, uh, I got to put this down. The stone. <laughs> she goes, ah. <laughs> I like that. So I, oh, I need, uh, oh yeah, I got stone here. I forgot to bring wood. Alrighty, folks. I have been collecting materials. And, oh, first thing is iron pit. This is what she gave us. And it requires one wood and an iron pit. And I'm thinking... It might be a comfort piece. Go ahead and plop it in. Fire. 16. Oh, the highest I'm able to get for comfort is 17. I looked at the wiki, and I do have everything that I could possibly place, except maybe this tree could be closer. I don't know. Because the tree might be 18. Now, it's not, I don't know if the tree is, it's seasonal, because I don't think I have it in my building menu. Well, it doesn't look like it's doing anything for comfort. So I'm not entirely sure what this is for. Um, put it on the table. <laughs> Burn the table down. I suppose I could put it here for aesthetics. I do need more light in in that area, the crafting area. Now well, let's go ahead and put some wood in there. All right. Well, I don't know what what the point of that is. I mean, other than it's just a unique furniture piece yeah, for lighting and all. All right. Now the barber shop. Now that's under furniture. And here it is. And I thought I'd put it in here because I have the most room. So I'll just toss it. Well, let's put it here, I guess. And there we go. So what does this do? Oh, look. You can, so you can change your appearance, yeah. Blondness, hair tone, all that. Long braided. 
Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Well, at least I know what that is. Now. Uh, it needed bronze nails and all this other crap. <laughs> now, one of the things that I gotta get in the practice of, which I'm starting now, is whatever, if, like, there's bronze nails and iron nails. And that, you know, I think that's it. And make sure you put the nails in where the material is. So that when you go to get, um, your iron, like, oh, I got nails. Instead of putting them in a case somewhere else, you know, that's kind of an inventory management um, thing that I found. Now, what am I supposed to do with this? One-handed. Okay. Well, there it is. It's a sparkler. <laughs> I wonder if it scares away the cre like those gray dwarfs. Oh, yeah, look, it's running out. Oh, no, that's my stamina. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's got a bar on it. This boar is going absolutely batty. So I, I, I think this is just kind of some fun thing. Doesn't attack. Yeah, you're frightened, all right. Oh, wait, we can do two-handed. Okay. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Oh, you. You don't like my sparkler? Why? Come here, you. Yeah, see how these animals are just going absolutely batty. And I've had this since I started this. Um, since I built in this area. Oh, it ran out. Okay, is it all gone? Yep, it's all gone now. Should've used this sword. Ho ho ho. Okay, let's put that away. Now. Uh, so yeah, I think that's just some kind of festive thing you can do. Got some food now. Well, I tell you, this game is just inventory management constantly. Oh, so I got... Here's the thing. Um, if you... If you forget, or like when you're converting gates over, because... Unfortunately, these only fit on the ground. So, uh, when it comes to upgrading, you know, your your stone or your portal system, um, this is, okay, I have I have this one. And you'll know, uh, I'll go in and edit. Now, you notice that I put a dot here. So, this is the initial. Uh, so, when I went out there, I set it up. I set this one up to Hilder, and then when I found her, I put one down, named it Hilder. Now, uh, I forgot to bring a stone bench with me, or stone uh, a stone cutter materials with me, I'm kicking myself, but that's not a problem, because I have this gate. So having a stone gate, you know, a portal, all I got to do is name this Hilder, and I named the one in the portal room, put a period at the end of it, you know, so it disconnects. Then you name this Hilder, and you can bring the iron through for the stone cutter, and then I can set up um, a stone portal now. Once you get this set up, you can take your workbench and your stone cutter back home and put the stuff back away. Because you don't, you know, what, there's no point in leaving a, a stone cutter. There's two iron in there. And I, I'm going to go through all the areas that I've set up and pull all those benches up. Except for the wooden one. Because I, that might keep respawns from happening. Might. All right. So let's go talk to her. And uh, if you'd help me get some things back, I'd be happy to do business with you. Oh, well, you're doing business with, with me now. So I wanted to buy I know. <laughs> that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> buy that. Uh -huh. uh, I like her her little quips. Mm -hmm. <laughs> cool. I like that. So there's the iron pit. So an empty vessel waiting to be filled with firewood and kindling. I wonder why it can't be teleported. That doesn't make sense. Unless there's something we can do with it. Other than just set it up. So I'll have to do some research on that. Okay. Oh, see you again soon. Oh, wow, that's funny. Okay. All right, now I got to find out where these map markers are because we 
can get her th some things. Now, I did kind of see something when I was researching, trying to figure out, is she going to be even on the map here, you know? And, uh, okay, let's, oh, okay, let's try these out. And, um, oh, that's cool. Still got my helmet on. Oh, and then we got a hat. Oh, wait a minute. Simple dress natural. Tunic. Oh, I see. We'll put these in. Okay. Now, I I guess this is, you know, you can be... Look at his neck. It looks weird. Uh, this could be for a guy or a girl. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know, fun stuff. Stuff, you know, to make the game more interesting. But we're going to go with that right now. Well, okay. This is really kind of lame. This right here is the map to all her crap. There it is. How am I supposed to know this is a freaking map? The graphics in the game aren't exactly, you know, uh, they're meant to be grainy and look, you know, look 8-bit, you know, almost in, in some cases. This is the... They gotta realize some people just don't, aren't gonna see that, you know? How was I supposed to know that's there? That drives me nuts. Well, here we go. Shouldering, uh, smoldering tomb, sealed tower. Now, it flashed it up there really quick. Um, okay. Ah, sealed tower, smoldering tomb. That's, oh, Jesus. Well, looks looks like I have to go here. <laughs> Mountain. Well, I'll take that out of there for now. Howling Cavern, Sealed Tower, Smoldering Tomb. Howling Cavern. They're taking you all over the place. Oh, this is crazy. Wow. So that's one, two there. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine total? Okay, I... That kind of annoys me that register chest locations. Okay, I'll unlock them to do good business. I'll unlock them. Oh. Okay, so uh, I think the way I want to tackle this is I'll get modder, I'll get my boat, and we'll head out. And at least what I'm looking at is doing at least one uh on screen now i don't know if these howling caverns are they related to the same thing you know because we've got oh we got two over here sealed tower a howling cavern there so if we get one thing does that mean she unlocks one thing that's special i don't know i, I haven't looked at any of that uh, my assumption is yeah it's three things um, cause I did see that there were three things, but I didn't look. I just like, oh, three. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm going to get my boat and we're going to do this. <laughs> oh God. Alrighty, folks. Viking ghost here. And about to embark on this first trader mission here. I've got modder. And I wish it was a longer amount of time <laughs> to get from point A to point B. Five minutes. That's, an, that's ridiculous. Should be, I think, ten with a 20-minute cooldown. So, well, ten-minute cooldown. So ten and you wait ten. Not five and fifteen. That's silly. I gotta, I gotta figure out how to mod this game. You know, or if, what the what mods are out there. So in order to get out of the damn uh, place, there, yeah, three. I think it. I think it was three. Uh, three. Oh, look at this, man. Wow. <laughs> Burn. Is he burning? Yes. Flame damage over time. Oh, you want some? What the hell is that over there? 
And, oh, this sword has got some reach, man. I love it. Look at the reach on this thing. Whoa, I love it. Oh, more. Hi. Oh, I, uh, yeah, these things, man, you gotta get at them quick. Or else they're, uh, they uh, got their poison spew. So there it is. The first question mark. So what I think is going to happen here is that there's th three locations that we need to go to. And that will complete the quest. Oh. Here. Oh, look. We got a hail warrior. Okay. I see you. Hold on. Oh, another one over here. One stars. One star skellies. That would scare you before. One star Greydor. All right. So, uh, what are you what are you going to say, Hugin? All right. I have a feeling that this place could be more challenging than one might expect. Watch your step. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Now. Thanks for the info. We'll grab that stuff. Ooh, blueberries. Oh, I got to unload some stuff. So what I wanted to do, I want to set up the my workbenches here. Hopefully they won't get trashed, but I, I got to get them out of my inventory anyway. And I brought this. Hoppa. Now I have a blank portal. Uh, let's see. I have to set up a blank portal at home, I think, because I don't have one there. Okay, so I don't know if I should. Oh, I gotta eat. Yeah, I'll have to go back and get more foods. Oh, you know what? Um, my well-rested bonus is gone. I wasn't paying attention to it. So I'm going to, I th it's morning now. So all I gotta do is squat, you know, oops, wrong way. Go over to the bed here and then get the 24 minute Resting, rested bonus. Yeah, and there we go. So let's go back. So this looks pretty cool. Now, okay, so uh, Smoldering Tomb. So what I'm thinking is we'll, we'll see. I want to see if, oh wow, look at this. Okay, looks like we're safe. I want to see if one, I, I think we have to finish all three in order to complete the quest and uh okay hi oh yeah one star uh skellies eh, flint head i'm not really using the flint heads it's one of those where you have to if i was going to go hunting deer i would use those um ah look at this what are you Oh, looky here. Wow. Okay, she's a baddie. Yeah. Not someone you want to mess with it really on. Brema. Oh, Brenna Trophy. Oh, cool. Look at that. Still burning somehow. Oh, neat. Oh, look. Brass chest. Oh, oh look at this crap. Please return to the fountain. So, weight 200. Holy moly. Amber. Oh. oh. Jerk. Oh, look at this. We got a few guests. A few folks. Oh, what happened to the thing? Yeah. Why can't I pick this? Come on, pick it up. There we go. What happened to the chest? I didn't notice what happened. Wow, look at all this stuff here. So, we got some... Uh, Oh, I see these little suckers. <laughs> They're spawning out of the chest. That's why I was like, wait, where'd these skellies come from? Okay, what's going on here? Yep, look at that. Chump. I want these golden mushrooms here because I've got a bunch from when I uh, went to get iron from the swamp. Wow, 200 weight. Look like I got my thing on. Yeah, I don't, well, yeah, I don't need these things there. Okay, so that's the challenge, too, is it's heavy. 
And there's a thing here. Okay, take that out. All right, I'm gonna go through this. See if there's anything good. And then uh, I think we'll, oh, we'll have to, yeah, we'll have to give it back to her right away. Because I'm not carrying around 200 weight. Unless, you know, we, we have to wait. We'll find out. Oh, hi. Well, this is very interesting. Come on, hit him. How they've got this uh, skeleton spawning from these chests are kind of a little... I like it. It's kind of cool. All right, I'll go through this, and if there's anything uh, that pops up, I'll let you know. All right, folks. Bonk! There's a flaming skull. <laughs> cool. All right. Oh, wow. Yeah, see, that durability is terrible on that thing. I got two of those. We'll get rid of that. So, there we go. It's a good light source. You know what would be cool is to... Oh, this. see, this thing ran out. So, taking this fire thing out and putting a, a horizontal... Uh, what do you call it? Holder? Uh, and then putting the skull on there. I think I'm going to do that. <laughs> That'll work. So, I got this set up to the trader. Temporarily here. So, I figure, you know, I can come back home... I got, I'll do PP for these spots, and and then I'll leave that home one there. Okay, let's talk to her. E. Oh. Let's do that. Property of Hildir. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. So, I guess you could stumble across those in the world. Oh, I see. All right. I saw this before. It says, give item. I saw this, and I didn't... It just clicked. One. Oh, cool! Look! Oh, cool! Whoa! All this stuff just went... Whop, whop, whop. Hilder's brass chest? Oh, look at that! Oh, I'm sheltered. Now, what does she have? Anything? <laughs> oh, look! She's got more crap! Oh, look at this. Why is this stuff more expensive? Wait, 10. Durability is high. Station, repair station one, armor one. I guess you can upgrade this stuff. I wonder. So I'm going to go to, oh, here. I think this is the one. Yeah, the only problem is my, the portal PP. It, it's, uh, this, I can't go through with stuff. Uh, with ore or whatever, with ingots and stuff. Okay, so I'm going to dis... Oh, here. So, map. And you can... Yep, so you can get rid of it now. The next one is Sealed Tower. Holy mother of God. <laughs> um, what the heck is this? Um... That's a screenshot if I ever seen one here for a thumbnail. Ooh, that's a good one right there. Check this thing out. Holy moly. I thought this was going to be the Mistlands. Uh, they went all out, folks. Holy crap. Uh, huh, huh. Mysterious Tower. Sealed Tower. Oh, you little jerk. Oh, wow. Oh, look, it's Hoogan. Come here, you. All right. Let's see what... They're all laughing at me. Hi, Hugan. I have a feeling that this place could be more challenging than one might expect. Uh, watch your step. Oh, it says watch your step. Oh, this is cool. Oh, okay. It looks like you have to build something to get up there. Well, the feather cape is definitely something you want for this. Yeah, I'm going to get my stone thing. Build some temporary stone uh, things, to, like stairs to jump up there. Okay, here we go. Uh, let's... Oh, God, these things. Well, I got another idea. Uh, just a workbench. And I don't know why shift is kind of 
farting out. Figures. Yeah, the uh, shift is supposed to allow you to um, place anywhere, but there still is a um, certain amount of locking. These things are a pain in the ass. Yeah, it's easier. The uh, tar monsters, one of, oh, they're, they're called the uh, strange creature, whatever they're called. Uh, they're a little bit of a pain. Okay, so this, yeah, this might work. Now, uh, so I'll go here and there. Now, grab this. And yeah, now I can jump up. Man, those things are freaking annoying. Okay, now. Ah, get up there. Wow. Oh, they're inside there. See them? Aha. Okay, now. So they can't get me. Oh, there we go. Uh, that's what I thought was going to happen. Damn it. One eternity later. Ha ha ha, I made it. Okay, now. Oh, hello. All right, we're in Iron Gate. Oh, we got some skeletons here. Um, what's this? Oh, you break it. Whoa. Oh, it's a one star. Uh, who are you? Okay. Okay, now. Uh, I, my assumption is we have to go all the way down to the end. What are these things? Why are they in these things? Oh. There we go. Oh, look. This uh, spiral staircase. Oh, neat. Uh, can I go up to the top? Yeah. Hey, we're up here. Oh, what's this? Um, oh, just some miscellaneous stuff there. Okay. Well, this is pretty cool. Hey, look, there's our boat. <laughs> and, yeah, okay, we got some... Oh, look, a trap. Armed. Well, I'm glad I saw that. That could have killed me there. <laughs> so we got close quarter fighting. So if you're not highly leveled here... You're going to have some fun. And I don't see any traps here. There's a bed. Oh. Oh. You need to go. Man, this flame sword is fun. I'm loving it. So I hope there's no... Tr oh. What do I got in here? Oh, we got iron... I don't know where I got this iron from. Get into that. Oh, the iron's coming from these gates. That's where it's coming from. Yep, there it is. Okay. I didn't look up there. So more or less trying to not get killed here. So, yeah, it's just free iron. I mean, I can get it anywhere. But I'll take a few with me here. Get that out of there. Hey, look at this. <laughs> Get him! Nice! Oh, look at that! Ooh, I got the gate down. With this thing, too. So, I can cast this thing through the gate. Oh, that's awesome. I wonder... There we go. Okay. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> you got to be ready, though, because there might... Oh, see? Trap. There, I, I broke the trap with it. Okay. Boy, this thing is... I tell you. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Oh! Oh, look! Zill and Thugger. Oh, wow. Eight, five. Zill and Thugger.
Oh, cool. I busted his ward. Where is he going? Oh, boy. He's ugly. <laughs> There he is. Oh! Here he comes. Look at him! <laughs> He's not happy! <laughs> oh, I got him! Oh, this guy. Whoa! Come here, you. Yikes. Wow, he's tough. Uh, I need some stamina here. Oh. Okay, I'm not getting much damage here. There we go. Ah, he had the he had the chest. That jerk. One new unlocks and message log. Yeah, whatever. So I got all this crap. Uh, I'm going to have to drop some. I'll have to come back for this stuff. Oh, I got all this iron too. That's fine. I'll, I'll take that. So. Oh my gosh. What's this? Ooh, a chain. Four chains. Those are hard to come by. Five chains. Heck yeah. Oh, we got Thugs Trophy. <laughs> oh, we got Zill's Trophy. Oh, wow, that's awesome. They got trophies for this stuff. Ooh, look. The Either it's lighting or multicolored. And look, it stacks to 20. <laughs> oh, my God. Feather Cape for the win. I, uh, <laughs> it's going to be a pain, but I want to get all the materials out of this thing. There is so much green and green and uh, metal and iron in there. It's insane, and I want it all. Whoop! Oh, I'm got that. Okay, let's go turn this into Hilga, and see what happens. It. I, I'm assuming every one of these is going to have a different thing, you know, a different display. Hilder, I got some good news for you. Uh, I got you some. I got your stuff. Uh, here you go. Oh, it goes over here. I love it. Oh, okay. It's the same thing. Oh. Okay, so it put out these hats. And then some cloth there. So it looks like it might drop down in front of some of these tables here. Oh, over here. Oh, look. This stuff opened up, too. All right. So there's some cool animations now, uh, beaded now, I think. Oh, look, we have basic fireworks now. This rocket, this rocket's blasting off again. Basic fireworks. So, uh, yeah, maybe there's more. So I noticed that they have different colors here. And let's see, extravagant cap. Whoa. What does this cost in here? Uh, 300 Fur cap, gray. And, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm looking to see if there's anything. Let's see. Warm fur cap made from the finest wool. Twisted. Head scarf red. So, yeah, I mean, it looks like the same stats, but just different stuff. Uh, I think they're trying to, you know, make it where, oh, this is, you know, higher grade or something. So I'm wondering, you know, is that all she's going to offer is clothing that has a stamina buff? I don't know. Uh, oh, I want to... Oh, I forgot. I want to sell the stuff. And I want to see what these trophies look like. All right. One, two. Oh, wow. Look at him. Ooh, he looks mean and nasty. <laughs> and this guy. Yeah, he looks pretty, pretty nasty. He looks like a real nasty guy. Zill trophy. <laughs> I love it. So, uh, I wonder if there's different enemies for each one of these quests. 
because they're named and they have that different, you know, they have a lot more health bar. It's, you know, different uh, color name. They're named and it has a color to it. The health bar has like a reddish brown kind of rust looking color. Holy cripes. That's pretty crazy. All right, so let's get that there. The vines did were uh, the unsung hero there for that quest, definitely. I'm going to get more food and get the boat. And I'm going to head back. Uh, we'll go to the next location. Okay, got my inventory sorted out. I, Yeah, I'm not entirely sure here. Let's see. We got Hildir there. Yeah, if, if this is clothing, clothing, clothing... Um, if there's anything different with the quests, then I'll break in and showcase it, because that's kind of that's kind of what I'm doing here. Uh, another thing too is I want to get this material out of here. Yikes! So I, I'll have to work on that. It's gonna take me a bit. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, here I am. <laughs> I parked my boat here. I ran up this mountain, and uh, it doesn't really matter where I landed, but this thing is huge. It's insane. And down here, ah, okay. Oh, oh, that's Hugin. Hi. What's this stuff? I wonder if I. Ooh, I like these. I like the blue rocks. All right, Hugan, what do you got? So I have a feeling that this place could be more challenging than you one might expect. Okay, yeah, I know. Can I break these? Wait, up oh, one. Can. Oh, it's coal. Oh. So is there anything else? No. Uh, I took out one of these. Um, oh, two, two of those uh, stone golems. I casted the vines and it took them out like quick so quick it was cool <laughs> okay well uh, i have a feeling i'm gonna need my fire howling cavern Ooh, cool all right i have a feeling i'm gonna need my your fire potion there so i shall traverse the cave Holy crap. There it is. Oh, he's got frost attack. Wow. Holy crap. Oh, boy. Let me get out of here. Yikes. Uh, let me close this door. <laughs> I don't think he can get in here. Um, let's do this. Do this. I wonder if I can cast it through the door. Oh no! My only protection. Hit him! Ah! Okay, they're hitting him. What's his name? Gar Garhapa. Oh, he's back there now. Man, these vines are amazing. Oh, look at that. Yeah, run in here. Boof. I missed. The vine popped him over here. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. There's the case. Hilders. Oh, silver! A silver chest. And Gerhafa's trophy. Cool. Oh, here. We got these things. Did I pick it up? I 
think I did. Yeah, I got it. Oh, look at that. He's giving you an icy stare. Cool. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, turn this in. And uh, we'll see. Boy, these things are confusing, man. So, uh, yeah, I was, like, walking around aimlessly. And I'm like, okay, maybe it's here, maybe it's here. Turns out it's up top more. <laughs> All right, let's go back to Hilga. Mm, bow, bow, bow. Hey, look at this. Well, well, girls, look what the neck dragged in. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. Here you go. Oh, yep. There it is. It's right there. I had a feeling it was going to be plopping stuff out over there. Anything else? Okay, so it flopped out that stuff. All right. Now, oh, yeah. She got more stuff now. Okay, so there is there's more stuff. This is more expensive here. Shawl dress and beaded dress i wish they had the price on there but they put it right there 500 450 i think it's sorting by cost except for these sparkler me i don't know maybe yeah these are 200 so i i don't know if the chest has any like the, it was a silver so does that mean it was a tougher one you know the caves so, I don't know. I'm not sure. We'll have to keep going, obviously. So, what I'll do... I'll collect the chests... Off screen. And we'll turn them all in at once. Next episode. And finish that off. And... I'll summarize. If, if there's a gold chest or something. Because I... I think it was bronze. that I, I wasn't paying attention. But yeah, it's, I think it was bronze, silver. Maybe there's some gold in there. And I think we'll put this guy right here. Oh, look at that. He's got leather wraps on his, on his head there. Oh, that's really cool. I love the eyes. Ha! Oh, that is awesome. So much creativity. So, also, too, when I uh, go back out, I'll let y'all know if the boss names change or whatever. So I'll try and capture the footage and maybe, you know, pop it in. Showcase like little snippets, you know. Kind of compile a whole thing. And, uh, but yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Wow, look at that. <laughs> Holy cow. So yeah, I could have came from on this side over here. So that one is done. We'll take that out. Oh, you know what? I'm going to mark it uh, here. Cave. There's another cave here. I'll exit. And then, I'll, yeah, I'll go get my boat. So I've got a sealed tower and a tomb there. So I did three this episode here. So one, there should be six more. So I'm going to go up and knock these two out. Then I'm going to sail way the hell over here and get these and then sail down this way and then go here. Okay, I'm going to tear this stuff out, get on the boat, and I'll uh, let you guys know what happened. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. It was fun. A little frustrating, you know, because it's not really clear sometimes. Oh, this is the map thing. You know, it doesn't jump out at you because I'm looking at her and I'm expecting her to give me the quest. You know, the quest markers. Why do I have to look down at a table? It should be her giving me the locations. The thing on the that she's standing in front of is could be a, just a prop. Is Oh, yeah, this is where they are. Uh, you know, she's plotting them but telling me. So I think that could have been handled a little better as far as just being intuitive, you know. Because not everybody knows what the heck's going on, but thankfully the wiki exists. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Peace out.